fam, it's your girl CC, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, I hope you see something today that inspires you to subscribe. Remember to click the like button. Remember to drop me a comment down below because I love talking to you there. And tell your friends, okay? Like, share the wealth. Today, we are discussing money saving hacks for the moms. We are actually making laundry detergent y'all we are making laundry detergent so you guys know on this channel you never know what you're gonna get but you're definitely going to get a look into my world so i hope you guys enjoy the sneak peek into what it's like to be a mom on a budget these days and um i hope it's something that you can use hope it's something that you learn that's new and i'll see you guys as we get into the video let's go Whoa, oh, oh. Da, da, da. Christmas memories. What you doing? Get my ride, get a test drive. Around, keeping people please. But this is my favorite house. Alright, what we gotta do? We are going to the laundry detergent section because y'all know, y'all know. Y'all know I be on TikTok and I, well, actually I was on YouTube and TikTok and um, people is making their own laundry detergent and you know, Mr. Let's Save a Dollar over here. So we're going to give it a try and I'm just going to make a small batch just to see how we like it and I'll let y'all know. Y'all know I'll let y'all know. About everyone else, isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas Laundry booster. It's five dollars. Well, it's four seventy six. Four at five ninety seven, so six dollars. So they're supposed to make more. Yeah. Than you buying the regular laundry detergent over here. Yeah. Cause with these you get what sixty loads or something like that. But it's an average. I have this one. Getting it. So this is. $5 too, so everything is like $5. So five times four is 20. We're gonna say it's $20. For the regular tie that I get, it's $20. So, but we get 100 loads. So I'm gonna see how many loads we get out of this and we're gonna test it out and see if it's if it's worth it. All right, so for the time being, we found this little hefty container. So hopefully this will fit everything and we'll get it mixed up. I wanted like a cute aesthetic little glass container, but we in the RV, so it's probably best. It's everything. Okay, I want the record to show that I was gonna get the hefty bag, the hefty bucket, but y'all friend said this is more aesthetically pleasing. He likes this one better, so I'm getting this one that's $16. And, uh uh, you already said, and not my five dollar hefty team. So I'm getting this one, and it's glass, so we're gonna see. But I guess I could always reuse it later. How many you get? Just one, oh. but you know, I want the one in the back that nobody touched. Are y'all like that? Like, y'all pick from the I pick from the back. Not only that, I have an obsession with mason jars, like, I use them for everything. Baby, this year it's just gonna be you and me. It is a brisk 43 degrees outside, y'all. It is freezing. So I think when we get home, we're gonna make some hot cocoa. You want some hot cocoa? <laughs> so I found this new way to make hot cocoa, so I'm gonna show y'all when we get home. So let's go. y'all let's make 
this hot chocolate. So y'all know I got my handy dandy milk frother. This one is by Nespresso, but I believe Instant Pot has one. Um, I'm sure they have all kinds. So we're gonna use this. So I like mine's like rich and creamy. So I'm gonna use milk and I'm gonna fill it to the, I'm gonna just use mostly milk. Flash of heavy whipping cream. And top it off with this Planet o Oat Milk Creamer. But you could use whatever kind of creamer you want or no creamer because the chocolate is sweet. But On TikTok, people are brewing their um, coffee in the Nespresso group that, I, that I'm in and on TikTok over Lindor truffles. But I also saw somebody making hot cocoa with Lindor truffles, so I'm going to make hot cocoa with these because I'm not in a coffee mood. So I just have them in my little man. Ain't he cute? But really, I keep them in there because y'all friends... Grayson, aka Toots, be in my candy. That's two. That's three and a half. Our milk is done. And another thing about the milk frother, like that's, if you have kids, it's perfect because the temperature, it doesn't like get it boiling hot. Like when you boil it on the stove or like in a tea kettle, it's like drinking temperature. It's tolerable for, for kids. Y'all heard the way I said that? This is good. It's good? Mm -hmm. Do we need anything? Mm -mm. I wish I had some whipped cream. It tastes good just like it is. Perfect. It's like a perfect temperature. It's a good, perfect taste. It's great. It's delicious. Or if you want to make it adult, add you some Godiva in there. Mm. So we ended up spending, so somebody could add this to our budget, $45.80. Now I know that's a lot, but the jar was the most expensive thing. Legit, the jar was $16. It would have cost $20.96, so $21 if we would have just got the laundry soap. So this is the jar. All right, let's get busy. This is the OxyClean stain removal. Cup of it. Cup of the Arm and Hammer Clean Sensation. is in the laundry it enhances the cleaning power of laundry detergent in the bathroom it cleans and deodorizes bathrooms and you can clean various surfaces including wallboard countertops glass and vial and vinyl tile so it's a multi-purpose tool these things i have never heard of but maybe you have so if you've heard of them or if you use them, let me know how you use them in your home or your RV. And I looked it up. It is safe for um, high efficiency washers and dryers. Ooh. All right now, make a mess, girl. 
And then this is the super washing, super washing soda, laundry booster, and household cleaner, deodorized, clean, and brighten. And also use this on your laundry in your kitchen and bathroom on your appliances and surfaces. You can use it on your silver, copper, and brass, and you can use it on your pots and pans. I didn't get a whole cup, but. So I think we could just go ahead and pour it in there because I just wanted to see. Okay, so we filled up our jar as much as we could. I even went through, y'all know I'm a mason jar girl. I try to tell y'all, so this is as much liquid laundry detergent as I have left. So we was it was time for this anyway. This was how much of the super laundry detergent I have left. And then this is how much borax I have left. Was mixed up. It smells really, really good. You want to smell it? Mm -hmm. mm. Smells good, clean, fresh. And then I had this scooper left over from something. I don't know. So I'm just gonna use that. But it says you only need two tablespoons of laundry detergent so I think one of these scoops is two tablespoons so that's what I'm gonna use so I got a load of laundry in I'm gonna open this when you're using powder detergent you leave this over here so I'm gonna leave it over there Ouch. all right so we got our scoop. Just pop it in there. It's on colors. All right. So that is our laundry powder. Today is number 12. We've done one load of laundry. Hopefully I could keep up with it to let y'all know how many loads of laundry this actually gave me. What I plan to do is to put a um, piece of tape up here and we just check it off for every laundry load that we do. And that way we'll know how many loads this gave us. All right, y'all. So it has been many, many, many hours later. We actually just got back from my company Christmas party. We had a great time. But the clothes are still in the washing machine, so let's put them in the dryer. Let's give them the smell test first. They smell great. All right, so I'll probably see you guys in the morning and let you know how these clothes dry. Okay. Chase is clean and soft they smell great they feel soft i think we got a winner you want to feel them smell clean all right y'all so i'm about to fold these clothes and um put them away but i think we have a winner on our new laundry detergent so if you try this hack this money saving hack this this laundry detergent recipe if you will let me know down below in the comments remember that the giveaway is still going so you must be a subscriber leave me a comment ask any question down below and that's your entry the more um, comments you leave the more questions you ask the more entries you get so i will see you guys in the next video happy holidays y'all peace